Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Jai Ma Kali. Don't you dare stay down when life knocks you down. Don't you dare think that you can't get up when life knocks you down. Everyone in this life faces such dire situations at some point in time. That does not mean you start spending your valuable time of life mourning over it. Life is too short to mourn. Remember, when you have been thrown by life to the lowest level possible and you know that you have hit rock bottom, then there is only one possible scenario and that is to go up. So rise up, fight back. It's time to make a comeback. A human being has the strength and potential to get up every single time he gets knocked down. You are not the first person to experience a setback. There have been millions before you and there will be billions after you. Every setback is a setup for comeback. It doesn't matter how many times you experience setbacks. But what eventually matters is how quickly and how many times you bounce back from your adversities. The longer you spend your time thinking about your defeats, analyzing your failures, blaming yourself or someone for your downfall, narrating your ordeal over and over again, the more difficult it will become for you to move forward in life. Your predicament is yours. Don't share it with anyone. People are not bothered if you are facing a tough situation in life or not. Because most of them are busy grappling with their own day-to-day -day challenges. Some of them would derive pleasure in knowing that you are in pain. So it's better to refrain from telling your story. The longer you spend time lying down, the more difficult it will become for you to fight back. Your fight back, your counter attack against that difficult situation should be immediate. That fight back should be now. We have heard this saying, when the going gets tough, the tough get going and the tough don't delay that process to act against problems. You have to show your resilience to the difficulties you are facing. You have to show your resilience again and again until your goal is achieved. If you have a resilient mindset, then one day you will see life getting tired of defeating you. You will see life tired of killing you. You will see life tired of knocking you down. It is actually normal to get knocked down. Because this phenomena is a part of our life. It is a part of our existence. But you have to remind yourself that you are down, but not out. There is still life in you and life is all about movement. And if you aren't moving, you are dead. You must go all out to achieve your goal and to live your dreams. That day is not far when you are going to reach your destination. Be sure that if you have survived until now, if you have survived those down moments in the past, if you have endured those painful moments in the past, then your resume tells me that you are more than capable of bouncing back. Don't forget, if your hardships don't kill you, they are just to prepare you for your greatness in life. Bhagavad Gita says, Whatever happened, happened for the good. Whatever is happening, is happening for the good only. And whatever will happen, will happen for the good also. You need not have any regrets for the past. You need not worry about the future. The present is happening. Let us all try to remain positive and see the brighter side of things in these difficult situations also. As it may turn out, bitter pills may have blessed effects. 
the misfortune could have a positive outcome in your life after all this is called life well if you wish to have an astrological help so that you could face your problems better or if you wish to know your future through astrology and live the best possible version of yourself if you desire peace and prosperity with my world class astrological and spiritual remedies and want to take your life from the ridiculous to the sublime from nothing to something then you can contact me on the numbers given on this video chai ma kali 9789 